So first, we're gonna start off the Works Hydro Shot. Here it is, it's a 40 volt system running two Milwaukee batteries that are 18 volts. What? How do you get 40? 18 plus 18 is 36. 18 plus, huh. They're both lying, okay, whatever. They both work. Um, <laughs> I'm just messing. Yeah, I mean, it's really funny. They're both false advertised, which is awesome. Um, always false advertise it's the way to sell products so seven what else can i say this is 725 psi 1.2 to 1.3 gallons per minute dewalt over here um one gallon per minute 550 psi i always want to say it's 0.9 but it's one gallon because i look here on the back you know, and it says one one gallon so to be fair i'm running both of these through two and a half gallon tank so i might have to actually hook up the dewalt might not win then <laughs> hey guys it has really low psi it's actually not working um that'd be not quite fair to that but there we go so tree again torture test um probably to do that bottom corner this would be one of the cleanest trees in the neighborhood um hydro shot has its pump sitting on the bottom which makes it a lot easier and lightweight does not help that i put a 12 amp on here wanted to be fair though this is a heavy beast of an animal because again everything in one so compact compactness this this wins technically because that's it that's everything right there whereas the works hydro shot is like too big so yeah because the pump and the hose or this is just a custom-made hose that i have garden hose just going to it but you're going to see in a second one of the advantages of having the pump actually sit on the water source. Because um, you could do it the other way. You can actually put this hose on the end of that, then run this tank, like let's say over there. So you're going to have more distance. So you can do that. Um, it's just going to take longer to prime. So I'll show you an example. Um, actually, I'm going to be fair and disconnect this pump too. So they're both going to be priming. Actually, So let's start with the DeWalt. So again, it's all ready to go. Oh, that's it. Oh, it had to be. Right. That was not fair because there was no water in it. So now here we go. So, you, you can tell the DeWalt takes a second to prime. It's kind of funny when they do that. Um, hydro shot. See, again. Uh, I kind of want to line up this nozzle a little bit so that it's more straight. All right. So, as you saw, it took a little bit to prime there, but it's, it's quicker than the DeWalt. So... All right, if you saw there, this is more fun to play with. Um, no, seriously though. Um, this is just a, a cooler setup that this works has. If you can tell I'm biased, you always want to be biased when you're reviewing these products. Um, I mean, I just, I've had this thing for a year and it just doesn't have the oomph that the Hydro Shot seems to have. As you can see there, like with a breeze. Um, again, pump being here, it's quicker to prime. I will be honest though, this, it's not fair, right? Because the pump is sitting up here and the pump is sitting on the tank. So not a very big comparison. So, um, yeah, because if you ran this through a hose, it would take more time to prime. But in these setups with the tank like this and the hose, that's quicker. But that thing's just a pain. It's just so damn heavy. Um, I just can't say anything better about it. Now you could say, hey, John, that's two batteries. That's one battery. I'm going to go with that. Go for it. Um, I just think the Hydro Shot um, is better because this is easier to handle with even two batteries on it. Um, two Monster 12s, though. For some reason, I'm trying to figure this out. I'll just be straight up. 
I haven't been able to run anything bigger than these 5 amps so far. I've tried the 12 amp and the thing just clicks like nothing happens. Also, I'm running batteries that are outside its league, so I'm not trying to, <laughs> not going to fault anyone there. Um, setups again will be in the previous videos explaining the whole kibosh and how you can get yours to look like that or to look like that. But overall, this is what I, I like. Um, that's 725 PSI. That's 550. Um, I just, I don't see how there's any advantage to that except it only has one battery. I just love that idea of that pump being outside of it. Long term though, I don't know. I just don't know how that's going to handle. I've had this thing for a year. I've beat it for a year. It's about, it like barely says the wall on it. Um, so overall though, if you like the video and you want to see more things like this, dumb things attached to other dumb things, let me know. Um, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Thanks again for watching and subscribe to the channel. Thanks. Bye.